welcome to our free education youtube channel uh, today i am going to show you how to do a scan using uh, hp smart tank 500 printer you can use the same method to scan a document on uh, hp smart tank 515 printer also uh, this is very similar today uh, i am using hp smart tank 500 printer i will show you how to uh, do a scan uh, using the HP Smart Time 500 uh, printer, this is uh, very easy. Very easy. First, uh, you have to install the correct driver into your computer. Uh, I, I I have uh, put the uh, link uh, in the description how to download and install correct HP Smart Time 500. Uh, printer driver into your computer because uh, normally Smart Time 500 uh, printer come without the driver cd so you have to download the printer driver from internet and install it manually so uh, i i have uh, given the uh, that uh, instruction video link on the description you can uh, go through it uh, so now uh, i am going to show you how to do a scan okay now i have installed my correct hp smart and 500 driver into my windows 10 computer the uh, if it is success uh, you can see hp smart tank 500 shortcut uh, icon like this on your desktop so double click on this link uh, icon then it will uh, open a small software window you can go to uh, scan section okay then uh, you can see scan document or photo so I click on that it will uh, open the HP scan window uh, now uh, you have to put your document uh, you want the ins uh, to scan uh, into the scanner of HP smart and 500 printer you open the cover and uh, put your uh, uh, document uh, on the uh, uh, glass in your printer scanner and close the cover then uh, there are some options you can select uh, it has the type document or photo okay uh, and you can uh, you can select the page size we are using a4 so i'll select a4 uh, you can select whether it's color or gray scale or black and white or uh, any other other options available so i click color you can select the file type pdf i have select pdf if you want you can select jpg email f pdf email at jpg there are some options i select uh, save as pdf okay uh, save send to local or network folder is automatically select that's the only option we have uh, then uh, you can click on scan button you can tick here show uh, viewer after scan so it will give a preview after the scan so i tick on this box and click on scan now uh, document will scan and you can see a preview on your left hand side of the window it's scanning now it will take a few seconds only not long okay now our scan has finished now you can see the preview i click on this then i can see a big preview here sorry double click we have double click uh, double click then i can see big preview here okay if you want you can select the area where you want to see your items so i select as this uh, now you can adjust the color if this is color is i think not so good so i will adjust from here i will increase brightness i'll increase my contrast uh, now it's good now it's good looking color okay uh, after that i can click on save button now it will ask a location to save i will save in my document 
uh, you can give a name to your scan document i will put test scan and i click on save button now uh, my file has saved in my document and uh, open the path path also open the place where i have saved my documents here i can see the document name i can double click now i can see the my scan document here very easy very nice nice color very good quality scan you can see okay yeah it's good good quality scan okay if you want to scan photo or if you want a uh, scan uh, more good quality uh, scanning you can select a photo from here it's got a scan or photo now it will open the scan window here you can select photo then uh, it will improve the quality of the scan automatically and you can save as uh, what we have uh, done uh, before so that's it that's it it's a very uh, simple method to follow to scan document uh, so i think now you have good knowledge how to do a scan using your hp smart time 500 or 515 printer uh, so if you like you can uh, click on like button if you are interested our channel you can subscribe our channel uh, so thank you for watching our video we will uh, see you again with a new video